daughter? She can't. She can't what? Mr. Redbone, welcome to my channel. If you're new here, make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell. And thank you for coming. Excuses. Um, I'm in the middle of doing a hundred things at one time. By the time the video is over, I'm gonna be so fresh and so clean. At least my face and my hair. Um, I'm actually I was cleaning over where my dogs are, and I said, Hey, this is content. Um, record this shit, girl. Sharing is caring. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and do that and I will come back to you guys. Just want to give you guys an intro um, and we'll be back. Okay. Okay, you guys. So this is the corner where my dogs are. They, their crate, their little uh, setup that I have for them. And like maybe three times a week, I sleep over here, get up all the dog hair. Because if you didn't know, English Bulldogs shed a lot. So... I make sure that I sweep all that up and sweep good and mop and bleach and all of that. Wash all of their bed clothes. I try to give them a bath at least once or uh, once a week or um, once every two weeks, depending how I'm feeling. Because these dogs are like 70 and 75 pounds. So, I have a bucket of water over here. So, in that bucket of water, y'all, I have some very, very hot water. Never mind, my head is cut off. I have some very, very hot water. I have some Clorox bleach in there. I also have some Dawn soap. I have these beads in there, the game beads. I love the way it makes my house smell. And some Mr. Clean. I have the, which one is this, y'all? It just says for breeze freshness, the blue. So I have that in there right now. I'm going to move that out the way. And I just have a, a, a cloth in there that we use for cleaning. So I'm just, I'm, what I'm doing is I'm right, wiping down all this dog here. Um, I'm wiping down the door. I'm trying to get all this this hair off of my curio cabinet. And then later I will come back behind it. Y'all, this smells so good. Later I'll come back behind it with uh, furniture oil and clean it good. Let me get y'all in there with me. Y'all never mind what I look like. I'm actually on the clock right now. So I'm working and I'm cleaning and I need to hurry up because I got to let my dogs back in. They can't be outside long because it is getting really warm right now. I think we're supposed to be... <laughs> Y'all, we're supposed to be going into the triple digits, so they can't be out for long. I'm going to give them a bath outside today. And what I do is I put them in like a, I put them in the kiddie pool. And I spray them down with the hose with the water on warm. Right now, the water is automatically warm, I guess, because it's so hot outside. But I couldn't go another moment with my cabinet looking like this. Just the, the dog hair gets on my nerves. So what I'm gonna do, you guys, is I'm gonna invest, body yaddy 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 yaddy. I'm gonna invest in one of those, um, what is it called, the back mop? I'm getting me one. I sure am. Y'all know I already have that electric mop. If you haven't seen it, it's in my cleaning video that I posted probably last week. And it has the details in the description box of what type of mop that is and where I got it from. I got it off of Amazon for like 100 and maybe 15 bucks. And it also, when I got it, it came with two extra cleaning pads. It came with uh, some pet solution for your mop. Sure did. It was a great deal. And I'm telling you, I'm using the hell out of that mop. Excuse the ring light in the background, y'all. So what I'm going to do now is get down. But I can't take it any longer. And it smells so good, y'all. So, let's talk about something, y'all. So, I was watching, um, I'm gonna go, while I'm down here, let's gossip. You wanna gossip? I'm gonna gossip. 
So I y'all I have one side of this with one side is my clean water, one side is my dirty water. But y'all, I watched what is that man name? Y'all know Jasmine, her ex that's on house arrest. Um, I watched his video. Um, I'm seeing that he's putting out he's putting in some putting out a lot of content. And I just want to kind of slightly react to his video that I watched. Now, this was the video that he was a little depressed on. And he was talking about how he got in trouble with his PO. Because he went and dropped off shoes to his kids. But it was not part of, uh, it wasn't on the schedule or something. So, I guess he can't, well, he's on house arrest. So, I think he can only pretty much go to work and um, back home. So, he... Didn't follow the rules on this one day. But he was trying to take care of his kids. I get that. But when you messing with them people, and you know what I mean by them people. When you messing with them people, you got to make sure you're doing what they say do. So I, um, I guess he had a little confrontation with his new PO. She's pretty rough on him. She, uh, she extended his house arrest for 30 more days. I guess that's a good thing. Um, he said he was working a really good job before at Amazon and she made him quit and work at the fast food restaurant. Like, that's dog. That is so wrong. I wonder what he did to trigger this person. Or do you guys think that this person is one of those people who get a little power and take advantage of it? Because why do you want to take the brother away from making money to support his children? Because he got a lot of kids to support. And he seems down to do it. He really seems like a caring father. Um, so why would you take him away from a job that's popping where he's making money? He said he was working 60 hours a week, y'all. And she took, took away some of his hours. Like, that was cold-blooded. You know what? My Instacart chick, did she get my punt, my sponges? I just got an Instacart for Family Dollar, but, oh, I ordered, I ordered some stuff off of Audis to cook tonight. I'm going to get y'all a cooking video out for next week, because I'm only doing two videos a week in a live, just so you know, so make sure the notification bells are on. But back to Philly Phil Phil, what is his name, in, what is his channel name, y'all? I'm Will Phil, I am, some shit, some shit, but y'all, I've been watching him. Um, I'm very happy that he did not come out dogging his baby mamas. That is so dope, and I'm so proud of him. That just shows the level of maturity. I think um, the information that was put out about him, as um, far as what we picked up from Jasmine, um, is that uh, the, the impression that I picked up is that he wasn't no good. Um, I felt like he wasn't a good father. Those videos that were put out about when he, you know, how he disciplined his kids. But what I'm seeing now is not... The impression that I was given is that just me or did I just take it and run and, and ruin this man's um, <laughs> his, his true identity <clears throat> so I'm just wondering y'all let me know what did we get the bad did we get a bad description of who Phil really was or did he turn around and make a difference change his ways what do you guys think definitely let me know in the comments because I am interested he said he was depressed with being in the house um which i can understand because you just got out of jail i guess you want to have a little more freedom but homie baby steps because when when you get out in the world and, and really have that freedom and you you better do you better do what they say do right now if they say sit down bro sit down y'all this smells so good I just want to get all this dust off and then I think once it dries, I'm going to take my hose and my vacuum cleaner and get all this stuff out the little crevices or I'm going to get a toothbrush or a sponge and get in there because it's got to go. I want to hit these baseboards while I'm down here because they have dog hair y'all all over them. I'm really trying to hurry up because I need to let them in his, uh, his vlogging serious you guys he took the kids um let me tell you what i've done so that's clean now what i'm going to do is go back over it with the furniture oil and get that shining um look at this door so this is where the dogs are i, I want it clean i can't take it anymore but yeah he's taking his vlogging serious he's trying to spend as much time with his kids it seems like um the other day i noticed that he put out a video where he went and picked up the twins y'all and i just thought that was so dope so dope that he's putting in um that time with the cheering you know and um that was dope so 
He said the kids keep them going, which I'm sure. And I'm sure that, you know, he's probably trying to make up for lost time. Y'all, I can't stand a dirty door. I'm sorry. Not sorry. And it just takes a little bit of elbow grease. I'm using that same water that I used on the curio stand, on the curio cabinet, china cabinet, hutch, whatever you want to call it. Just give it a quick rub down because I got to let them back in and mop over. Well, I got to mop over here first. And then I'm going to throw their cushions with a lay on in the washer. And I usually wash them twice, y'all, because I got a problem. Um, back to feel and multitasking. Remember that. It's really not a video where you, I want you looking at me. I'm cleaning. We're gossiping. Let's talk about it. So, um, y'all, did y'all know that he had a daughter that he said, uh, was adopted out by the mother? He said he did not sign over his rights. So how does that work? Do they get like a limited amount of time where they need to step forward and say, hey, that's my baby. I want her. Um, or does he still have any rights now that the baby is actually adopted out? Like he said, he saw pictures of her and she looks happy. Amen for that. Um, and if mom couldn't take care of her, I'm glad that she, you know, she got up enough courage that you could know. or can do about it. Again, he's not happy with that job. He went from Amazon. And anybody who knows about Amazon, Amazon will give your ass some hours. Amazon will give you OT. For real, for real. So I can imagine that he really was making some pretty good money. Especially doing 60 hours a week. 20 of that would be overtime. No. Yeah, shit, no. He was getting some money. He was working hard. 60 hours a week, not 40. He was grinding, y'all. He was trying to, he trying to take care of some business. And I guess he at home with moms. That's got to be difficult. You know, two grown folks in the, in the same household usually mm, don't work out too well. The new PO, new PO seems to be kind of rough on the bro. You know, you better not be trying to do nothing you ain't supposed to feel because uh, she ain't having it. No stuff. Y'all, it makes such a difference. This door. Take a wet towel and go over and get all this stuff off. And that will be that. I got my baseboards over here. What I try to do, y'all, because this house is so big, I usually try to pick a room and do those baseboards. I hate baseboards. If you know what I mean, let me know. This, and and y'all know this, this, this bracelet thing, this uh, house arrest shit has really changed. Like... Not that I know personally, but I know I've known people growing up who've been on house arrest and best believe these people can track your location now. Technology is a motherfucker. So if you ain't got no act right, you better get some. They will lock you the fuck down and know where you are 24 seven. Sit down. You better sit down. Do what you're supposed to abide by these laws. Stop playing with these people. You know what I mean? These people. Stop playing with it. He'll never come on here and down any of his baby mamas. And that is so dope. Like, why? What would you get out of that? But, you know, people in this world, they are so devious and so hurtful and, and deceiving that you never know. You never know. But Phil is vlogging. Phil is spending time with his cheering. Um, and that is so dope. So, had talk to you, Phil. We're going to see how this all play out. Um, let me know what y'all think about the video. And... And I'm gonna let y'all see the finished product once I get my dogs back in the house and the area is all the way clean. All right, so here you guys, I'm pulling, I'm pouring boiling hot water, a little bit of dish soap in there. I'm gonna follow up with some gain beads you know the ones you put in the washer smells so good you guys and some boiling hot water try it um some mr clean febreze and some bleach um and that's how i mop my floors i always boil water try it it gets the scum up really quick and sanitizes the area okay so right here is where i'm gonna go ahead and mop this floor get it sanitized make it smell great um, I do this at least three days out the week, um, depending on how my OCD is going. But 
yeah um i cleaned the hell out of this spot it looks so good i got those baseboards y'all i hate cleaning baseboards but yeah now if you need some cleaning motivation y'all pull up um hoarders hoarders will make you clean the heck out of your house so for future reference y'all i'm hooked on hoarders okay. um so my 600 pound done. life shit like that i'm getting up and i'm cleaning up some stuff i put that black Just gate so over there to block them from touching my china cabinet because i see that they're starting to scratch at it um their bed has a clean has clean bedding down there nice and fresh for breeze. i mopped the hell out the floor about three times their food is ready with you guys let's see Food is ready for them to come in and eat. This is their second meal of the day, y'all saw. Um, and y'all, this is where I sit and I work. And everything is just clean. So I gotta get back to work. Uh, and I'll come back to close out the video. But let me know what y'all think of the cleaning slash gossip slash reaction video. Um, and it's just so, it smells, I wish we had smell a vision where you guys could smell it. All right, you guys, um, I don't know what happened to my audio on here, but thank you for watching the video. Let me know what you think about the reaction slash cleaning video. If you think that's something you guys would like to see from this point on. And again, make sure that you like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. Make sure your notification bills are set to all and share me out. I am not a secret.